Hey guys, Jay here with HTJ Custom Wraps. So, got a surprise for you. Um, we're gonna try this material. Cameraman, there we go, pan over. I got HTJ Jr. on the camera, just to let you guys know. I know you guys love HTJ Jr. Um, it's my son, Diesel. So, so what we're gonna do here is, this is um, Flexi Shield Gloss Carbon Fiber. And, this is very expensive material, but we're going to try it and see if we can do it. This is essentially a cosmetic PPF. Cosmetic PPF goes on dry. Normal PPF goes on wet, but the cosmetic goes on dry. It's very sticky. I heard it's very challenging, but me and HJ Jr. are going to try it. So we're going to actually wrap the personal car, which is the 2016 uh, STI, and we're going to do the fender. So once we kind of get it on and I kind of start working it, we'll go back to the video and you guys see the process. Hopefully it comes out good because this sheet right here costs almost $300 just to do two fenders. So we'll see how it goes and hopefully I can start offering in the future. Okay, so we're gonna measure out what we need. Here we go. So we're going to measure out this bumper or this fender is going to be need a piece that is 43 inches, which is three feet, seven inches long. And to make sure we're right, we're gonna stop here and go down at, let's just to be safe, let's do a little extra. I'm not sure this is gonna, I'm not sure this is gonna lay. So I don't know, a lot of times with vinyl, I can cut it a little shorter, but this I might need extra to be able to pull and manipulate. So I'll give myself an inch up here and down here. So I'll probably do 23 inches, so one foot 11. So let me cut that and we'll start laying it. Okay, so we've cut our piece. It's right here. So this material has a liner on it. So we have to basically pull the liner. So, oh, dude, the liner's crazy thick. So here, so we're gonna do the liner. We're gonna see, this is crazy, awesome looking carbon fiber. Zoom in, check that out. That looks like legit carbon fiber. So that's pretty exciting. Okay, so let's do this, let's take it off. Kind of nervous because this is, uh, I guarantee it's gonna be a lot of work. But that legit looks like carbon fiber and I'm hoping I can lay it right and it's gonna look like carbon fiber fender. All right, here we go. I was about to pull the liner. Or the vacuum paper and see how that goes. Okay, time to squeegee. Okay, so this was a lot more challenging than I kind of thought. I thought it'd be really thick, like some of the really like crappy like China brand material. It was thick, but a little different properties, doesn't really, didn't really want heat, but here it is, we got it down, and it, it looks good, it really does. It really looks like, I think once I trim it out, it's gonna look like legit carbon fiber. Um, I can see, because I did it, I had to throw some heat right here, so I can see a little bit of blemish in here, but, Maybe the sun, once it hits the sun, it pulls itself out. I don't know. I don't really know what this stuff's going to do. But it does look cool, so I'm going to trim it out. And then I'll show you uh, what it looks like when it's fully done. Okay, so we just finished wrapping the fender. And there's and the, on the STIs, there's two parts to the fender. There's like the main part and there's like a lower part that's, that comes apart, so I have to wrap that. But we just wrapped it. I just trimmed it out and cut it. So we're gonna show it. It looks super good. So here, check it out. Okay, so we'll go a little closer so we can really kind of see. The, actually, we had a stretch right in here and it really didn't distort or wave the lines at all. I was very concerned with it doing that, but it feels really good. It's really shiny. I wish it was sunny out because we'd really get to see it, 
The only part I have left to do is this, this. I did this, but it's all, see it's separate pieces. So it's this piece and this piece, and then the way it has to sit, I have to do this piece and then that piece and then this piece in order to make it look right. But overall, it wasn't horrible. I'm really happy with it. And I think with more work, I'll just get better and better at it. And I'll be able to offer it to more and more people. And even if it's just something really small, like someone wants their chrome piece in back looking like carbon fiber, um, this stuff doesn't stretch really well at all as far as what I've seen. So I don't know if I do like like this mirror cap. I'm not sure if I would do this mirror cap in it. I'm gonna like do a seam here because I think this transition here requires a lot of stretch and I don't think it would look good with that carbon fiber because of what it does. But maybe just like a more like a half circle, just heat it and press it through. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe the roof in might look good, I don't know. I think about doing the back of my spoiler, top of that carbon fiber, we'll see. A lot of things are could, could be happening and I want to try there's a lot of different colors this I want to try the different color cosmetics and we'll see how it goes so thanks for watching you guys if you like this video please like subscribe turn on the notification give me a thumbs up leave me a comment tell your friends and family and I'll see you guys in the next wrap peace